Two bean-shaped objects about the size of a large tomato occupy a space near the abdominal cavity that we call the flanks. We call these objects, these organs, the kidneys. And although they don't enjoy the celebrity status of, say, the heart or the brain or some of the other organs like the lungs, kidneys are critical to health and well-being, and taking good care of them is, is vitally important. Kidneys uh, uh, perform the function of, of cleansing our blood and filtering out toxins and impurities. They promote the production of red blood cells. They help control uh, high blood pressure or hypertension. They're essential for bone health. And finally, they maintain critical acid-base balance. So taking care of them for your health and your well-being is extremely important. So what can you do to take good, what can you do to take care of your kidneys? Consume a diet rich in fruits and vegetables and omega-3 and 6 fatty acids. Some people call this the Mediterranean diet. And internationally, it is endorsed by health professionals to promote overall well-being for all of our organs and for, for health. So a Mediterranean-style diet is important to, uh, to kidney health. Control your blood pressure. Hypertension causes kidney disease and kidney failure. Your blood pressure should be no more than 140 over 80. So make certain that you take the medications as prescribed. Follow up with your health professional regularly to ensure that your blood pressure is under good control and it's not causing any harm to your kidney. Exercise regularly. Most, uh, um, per session, most people should exercise at least 30 minutes most days per week. So get the exercise in a little cardio fitness, a little resistant exercise, all good for you uh, in that way. Diabetes is, a, is really a kidney killer. And if diabetes goes uncontrolled for a significant period of time, your kidney failure is certain to occur. And then that means dialysis, and, and there's, nothing, uh, there's nothing fun about dialysis. So uh, make certain that you're taking your diabetic medications, that your hemoglobin A1C is seven or less, and follow your doc doctor's advice around uh, the care of your diabetes. Lose weight. Again, exercise regularly. All of that is good for proper uh, diabetic care. If you smoke, would you please stop? Smoking is bad for everything. Need we say anything more? Smoking is bad for everything. So get rid of those Dargon things. Any medication that is prescribed to you by a physician, you should say and ask, doctor, is this medication okay for my kidneys? If, if there's equivocation around that, uh, ask if there are some alternatives. Don't take medications which are pen potentially harmful for your kidneys. And really important is you should never take Advil, uh, Aleve, Ibuprofen, Motrin, Naproxen, any longer than a three week period of time uh, without consulting your physician. All of those medications called non-steroidal anti-inflammatories wipe kidneys out. Do not take them unless it's clear from your health professional that it's A-OK -okay and that a little longer won't be harmful. But watch those, the, watch those uh, really, really very carefully. Drink lots of fluids every single day. A couple of quarts will do and even more to help flush the kidneys, to help cleanse your blood and to improve your overall well-being. And finally, get seven to eight hours of great sleep per night. This is Dr. Jim for Be Healthy, Be Happy. Power your path to happiness. Take good care of your kidneys. And be sure to subscribe to Dr. Jim on YouTube. Be healthy, be happy with Dr. Jim.